Hello, George. Good evening. How are you? You're back in the fold, huh? I've been trying to get back in the fold, but the, the time that you've been learning has been not so I easy know. for me. Very I challenging know. because I go to the, uh, the shul and they need me to make the minion. Then I help my family. I make food. and uh, Anyway, no excuse. The good thing is that I keep myself up to date. So I'm up to date on the DAF. You guys are up uh, actually a little bit ahead of me. You're, uh, you're, you finished 60, the 62 yesterday. So we're doing 63 tonight. So it's going to be good. How about you? How are you? How are you? Uh, 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 uh. Okay, I didn't say anything me. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm good, good. I'm enjoying a nice warm evening. Very much. Yeah. <laughs> Makes me very sleepy, unfortunately. I, I, was, just, I was just rubbing my eyes. <laughs> you know, nothing you can do. No. But you know what? It's all good. Yeah. Considering how hot it is in the other parts of the country, Oh my did God! You, Europe too. Did, did you hear the the temperature of the Atlantic Ocean in Miami? No, no. was it? Today was ninety eight. Holy moly! That's I, terrible. I heard it twice because I said maybe I didn't hear right. Maybe when it was hot. I, I can't. Wow. Okay. When I when I lived in Miami, in the summer it was seventy six and it was hot. The water. But it's like a bathtub. That's worse than a bathtub. It's going to kill all the fish because the amount of oxygen that can dissolve in the water is dramatically down. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's terrible. Unless I heard it wrong, it was terribly high. That's a terrible thing. Yeah. Uh, I was commenting that I have been so challenged because seven o'clock is just not an easy time to, for me to get on. Uh, he switched it. Let's see. He's only five minutes late. <laughs> So here it says different. Here it says he was. Let's see. It said 87. I'm sorry, I was wrong. 
87. 87. That makes more sense. But even so, that's very that's still, hot for the fish. Eighty for the ocean. Yeah, it's terrible. It's probably true, particularly in the shallows. I don't yeah. know where. So I used to. Well, nothing with you. Tonight? Nothing. No, no, no. In Miami, the water, eighty-seven degrees. Oh boy! All the all the sharks are out then. <laughs> <laughs> dead, dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. But who's in Miami? You in Miami? No, I heard in the radio. And then oh, I checked it yeah. here. I, I heard 90 something, but it's 87. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry. It's 87 now. And it's oh. 11 o'clock at night in Miami. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Good evening, everybody. Hi. Good evening, Ernie. Hi, George. <laughs> This is a much more doable time. <laughs> like 8.30, yeah, 8.30 is the, is the best time. Yeah. The best time. Okay, we're on 63, Samech Gimel. Bishlma i itmar ifka. If the hus, if the, the, we're talking about the wife and the husband making shaliachs, like a husband can send the get via shaliach, that's called a shliach laholacha. A woman can appoint a shliach to accept the get on her behalf. That's called a shliach lekabon. So if the woman said is kabeligiti, he she appointed a shliach to accept her get. And the shliach went back to the husband. And said, The shaliach wrongly reports to the husband that the wife had said, Bring me the get. The who, the husband says, Do whatever she said. That once the get reaches her hand, she becomes divorced. Alma. Her hand or the agent's hand, Ernie? Her hand. Because you're. Oh, oh. Huh. Even she no. can't get the yado. His the hand. Shaliyah's hand. hand. Good point. Even she can get the yado. That means because she had originally appointed him a Shaliyah Kabola, which if the get hits his hand, it would work. Even though. The shaliach reported wrongly to the husband what she had said. And the husband said, oh, do what she said. And in that case, Rav Nachman reports, once the get reaches the shaliach's hands, his divorce is good. Yesterday, we learned that he said, even if the get reaches the woman, it's not a good get. Because he basically, since the shaliach didn't report properly, it's like this whole shlichus was nullified. But here, so the Gemara wants to say, if we would have learned opposite, where Rav Nachman would have said, once it hits the Shliach fan, she's divorced, Alma. We could have said, Adibura didahu kosamich. Basically, the husband told the Shliach, listen, I'm relying on what the wife told me. Since the wife made him an official Shliach Kabola, I understand why Rav Nachman says, the moment it hits the shliach's hand, she becomes divorced. Or inami. If Rav Nachman would have said she's mugureshes only when it hits her hand, we would have said adi The husband is relying on what he said, which because he said heilech, take it, take it to her. So he sort of switched the shliach and made him a shliach halacha. So fine, but elahacha. In the case where we said the get's not a get, it's the Baal's not relying on either word, not on his word, not on the other word. It's because Mishum Dakrishusa. But the Shliach himself sort of nullified the whole Shlichis. How? Sha'omar Shlich Kabbalah Vina. 
by saying I'm a shlich lekabola, it comes to me that I do not want to act as a shlich lalocha. That's a lot of tircha. I have to take it from you. I have to bring it to her, and therefore, he, he, there's shlich, There's no shlichus anymore. Okay. So it really doesn't inform us who the Baal is relying on. It's just different cases. Toshma. Come in here another case. The man is appointing a shliach lohoilocha, but he uses terminology get, except again, which is not really holocha terminology. Oh. Holich gets elishti. Take this get to my wife. In both of these cases, rotzalachs or yatsu. If before the get reaches his wife, if the husband wants to go back on it, yatsu he can, because uh, it doesn't it doesn't become operative until this shliach reaches the wife. Taima rotz. So that's he wanted to go back on it. In low rots, if he doesn't want to go back on it, how do he get? We would say that once the get reaches the wife, it's a good get. Ramai? His skabel get zeli ishti is not the proper language. Why should it be a good get if the get reaches the wife? He didn't use the right language. And a husband can't appoint a shlich le kabbalah, only the wife can. So we say a new concept. Amrina. This husband obviously has decided to divorce his wife. Meimer Omar, Tigorsh Kolhechi de Megarsha. I want the divorce to be effective, anyhow, any way it can be effective. Whether it's Kabbalah, whether it's Oilo. And saying it's Kabbalah, get the Ishti doesn't remove the concept that he wants to divorce her. Ghanami, all those cases that we talked about, Rav Nachman, even Shinosan of Lagarsha, Omar Tigarish Kolechi de Megarsha. Let her be divorced any way she wants it. And if Mor says, Achyash, there's no comparison. Awesome in the case of his Kabbali Getli Ishti. Adam Yodesh in Shlichus Kabbal. Everyone knows that a husband cannot create a Shlichus the Kabbal, only Shlichus Lamacha. Gamar Venosal Shem Alacha. Therefore, in his mind, he's really appointing this Shlich as a Halacha Shlich. The fact that he said the word is Kabbal. He wasn't doing it to make him a shlich kabbal. He's making him a halacha kabbal. And in the other case, hocha toy. On the on the case where the shliach comes back and tells the husband a different story from what the wife had told him, the husband is relying on what the shliach said. So the, the two cases are not comparable. Amar Rav Toshma. Ketana Sha'amra is Kabilikiti. A minor, a husband's allowed to marry off his minor daughter. And the Kiddush is a full Kiddush. And the Ketana attempts to appoint a Shaliach to accept the get. So a Ketana doesn't have the power to appoint a Shaliach. She's not a Bardas. Therefore, ain't no get actually get get the yad dog. The get has to actually reach her hand. So kimati git to the yad dog mia megarsha. Okay, sounds from that halacha that if the get reaches, even though she attempted to make a shliach with kabbala, if the get reaches her hand, she's divorced. Ramai, vahalav shliach loylocha shavia. The husband had not appointed that guy to be a shleich halacha. El Amrin and Kivin Shnos name Lagarsha. Since he's already decided to divorce her, Meimer Omar, 
Tikosh kolech le begarsha. Let it work the way it can work. Achanami in this case of Rav Nachman also kivin shnos le begarsha meimo amet tikosh kolech le begarsha. Or the Zachiyash again, no comparison. Hasam adam yudeh shen shach bekatan. Everybody knows that a katana cannot make a shlich a shliach. Therefore, gomer v'nasan law shemalachat yudeh. The husband understood that the shliach that he's appointing is a shliach halacha. But in the case of Rav Nachman, is hachatoi when the shliach comes back and says different words than what the wife had told him. He, the husband relies on that. So you can't compare the two cases. Toshma. <laughs> Bring me my get. And the shliach says to the husband, Ishtacha amri skabeli giti. He again, <laughs> the story. He says that the, the wife appointed him a, a Kabbalah Shlia. Or vice versa. The wife says to the Shliach, it's Kabbalah And when the Shliach meets the husband, he says, bring me the gift. And the who, the husband says, Omar, he either says, Hoylech, take it, Tain law, give it to Zachi law. Accepted on her behalf, is Kabele. Ratzalachzor, yachs. Until the get gets to the hands of his wife, he can go back. But and Mishigia get liyada. Once the get reaches her hand, miguresh. Now, my love, aren't we talking about in this brayso that Kabbalah? All of these languages that the Baal used, Zachi law, Tzkabil law, is making the Shaliyah, Hashliyah Kabbalah. And the Lashonis of Hoylacha, of Hoylech, Tain law, is Hoylacha. And yet the Baraisa gives us the Allah, that the get is a good get once it reaches her hand. So these, this price seems regarding the husband making the guy a shliach Kabbalah goes against what Rav Nachman said that if the Isha said have, bring it, and the shliach changes and says tiskabel, there we said the woman is not divorced until it actually reaches her hand. But more so slow. The husband is not using languages of Kabbalah, Hoylocha, like the woman, or Hoylocha, or Kabbalah, the way the, the, the woman appointed. And therefore, he's appointing his own Shliach Hoylocha. And once it reaches the wife, she's divorced. That's not a problem. Well, e Kabbalah, Lohoylocha, if we're talking about that the Baal is appointing a shliach le Kabola using a language of Oilacha, because a woman also uses a land, language of Iskabel, if it works for the husband to make him a shliach le Kabola, she shouldn't just be divorced when she gets the get in her hand. When the shliach gets the get, he made her a shli- he made him a shliach kabbalah. Yet the baraisa said that the get is only chal when it reaches her hand. Comes from here, shmami no tariburi dekosomer. He's relying on the on what the shliach said, and he's making the shliach a shliach loylocha only, regardless of what who had said anything about kabbalah. So the more says achiyashda hasam kamer lay. There, the husband said, he left Kamash Amra. The husband had said, you bring it according to the way the wife wanted it. So he said clearly, once, once it's done the way the wife directed traffic. But here, the husband never invoked what the wife had to say. 
But Rabbah, the woman says he's Kabbaligiti. The woman appoints a shaliach and says, accept for me again. The shaliach comes to the husband and says, Ishtacha Amr is Kabbaligiti. And the shaliach says, you know, your wife appointed me to be a shaliach la Kabbalah. The husband, if he wanted to divorce her, would have just deposited it to get into the hands of the shalia. Once the shlich le Kabbalah gets it, she's divorced. But that's not what the husband said. No, go and give it to her personally. Yet, the Baraisa says, meaning the moment the husband gives it to the shalia, the way the wife had appointed him to be a shlich Kabbalah, the get is chal. Now, Rav Nassim argues. Rav Nassim Oymer, if the Baal says, Hoy lech la, so then it's clear that he's not accepting the shliach as a shliach like Kabbalah. He's turning him around, making him a shliach hoy lacha, and therefore Ratzelach zu yachso, because he clearly there doesn't want to accept what the wife did by making a shliach Kabbalah. He wants to send it through a shliach Allah. And therefore in that case, until the get actually reaches the woman, she's not divorced. But if he use language, after the shaliach came to him and said, I'm a shaliach le Kabbalah. And he says, Zechila, fine. Accept it on her behalf. Or his Kabbalah. Or accept it. In Ratzelach, or lo yasu. Because it, he went along with what the wife said. Rabbi Yomir Bekula in Ratzelach, or lo yasu. According to Rabbi, no matter what the husband says, since the sh woman appointed the shliach as a shliach with Kabbalah, the moment the get hits his shliach's hand, she's divorced. Avalim Amarlo, the exception is if the husband says, I don't want you to accept it on her behalf. <laughs> so the diff question we have, Rabbi Ainu Tanakama. What's the difference? It seems to be the same thing as the Tanakam. You have to use the word E-F-S-H-I. According to Rebbe, you must say it. According to Tanakam, you don't. Very simple answer. Who is the Tanakama? It's Rebbe. The Baal says, Take it. So according to the way we learned in Rav Nachman, is it kishi dami? Is it as if he's saying to him, be zoicha on behalf of my wife, and therefore the moment the shliach gets the get, she's divorced, and he can't go back? Oh, love kishi dami. Or is it not like, be zoicha in it? Toshma. Ha'oyme yiskabu get ze li our Mishnah wants a yasu yasu. If a husband said, be miskabel or take it, he can go back. However, if the woman appointed the Shlich Kabbalah, there, the moment the get reaches the Shlich Kabbalah, he's divorced. So, my love, perhaps it's we want to be medaye that this is a case where the husband said to the shliach hilech, and this is the sheet of Rav Nos. The Gemara says low. He used the language of hoylech like Rebbe, that any language that the Baal used, he can't go back. Toshma. If after the shliach shows up and says, the wife appointed me a shliach like Kabbal. And the husband says, I don't want you to be the shlech. Ella, you have to turn around and go and give it to her. Because that works. Taima, because he said, And my love, behilich, karav nosen, and it's kitzchi dami. What's his low? Behoilech and Rebbe, and Rebbe said, no matter what terminology the husband used, he can't go back. 
Toshma. Husband says, Hoylich gets Elish. Ratzalachsu Yachsu. However, if he says, Hilech gets Elish. Ratzalachsu Loyachsu. Now, man shamus lead the Omer Bahoylech, Ratzalachsu Yachsu Rav Nosanu. The Kamer Behilech. So it's the same Rav Nosan. We just asked our question. What is Hilech? What's Lazar Loyazo? Shmamina Hilech Kishidami. According to Rav Nosan, Shmamina is a good proof. Itma. The wife says, he's Kabeligiti. He makes, she makes a Shaliach to be a Kabbalah. And when the Shaliach gets to the husband, he says, V'ishtecha Amra is Kabeligiti. He reports correctly that the wife appointed him a shlich le kabbalah. The who the Baal says, Oimer hoylech v'tein la. Now by adding the words hoylech v'tein la, is that enough to refute his status as a shlich le kabbalah or does it, even without saying efshi? Am ravab, am ravun, am rav. Nase shlucho and vishlucho. It becomes his shliach halacha and remains the wife shliach le kabbalah. And if the husband dies without children, between the time when the get was given to the shaliach until the shliach actually gives it to her. So it's a suffer. So she needs chlitza from the other brothers. Reuben, Shimon, Levi. Shimon, Reuben dies. Shimon and Levi are brothers. Reuben died without children. So she falls. So she gets chlitza. She needs chlitza to the brothers because maybe she's not a divorcee because maybe maybe the, what the Baal said reverses the fact that she had made a shlich le Kabbalah. So to marry somebody else, she would need chlitza. But the brothers can't do yibum because maybe she was divorced. So le meimra, the mesafkele le rag, he hoylech kishchi dami, olav kishchi dami. This terminology that the husband used of Hoylev is <laughs> in doubt if it meant Kizchi. So then the moment the get reached the Shaliach, she was already divorced. So you and if and if it's or maybe it's not, she's not divorced. So that's why there's a doubt. How can you tell me that we're in doubt? The Haitmar, someone says to Shliach. I owe Chaim Yankel $100. Take this $100 and give it back to him. Until it actually reaches the hand of the, of the guy that he's sending it to, if the money gets lost on the road, Rav has not fulfilled his duty to pay the guy back. Now, in Balachzor, if the one who sent the money wants to take the money back, ain't a choyzer. Because, in a sense, the shlich was already zoich for the balcha. So, if he used the word hoylech, it's kizchidami. So, why, why should he have a suffix? Oh, awesome suffix, mamona lakula. By money, it's, we go lakula. And we don't Take money out of somebody when there's a suffix. Oh, a suffix is sur These are, this is Aisha Zish, this is Isurim. By suffix is sur, we go lechum. Amaran. Ain't Aisha always a shlich like Kabel Lagita, we had shlich by me. A woman cannot appoint a shlich like Kabbalah to accept a get from. The shliach that the husband made. Rav Chaim Amar Isha also shliach with kabbalah gitim yach shliach b'aylo. Tanakam seems to hold that 
the woman can only appoint a shlich lekabola and accept it from the husband himself. But according to Rav Kanina, the, shlich, the, shlich, the two shlichim can deal with each other without the primary husband and wife being involved. So Rav says it's got to go directly from the husband without shliach to shliach. Why? My time in the Rav. It's embarrassing or degrading to the Baal that, that she doesn't want to accept the get directly from the Shliach, but rather is appointing another Shliach to be Makabalit from the Shliach. So it's degrading. There's another reason that the Gemara brings forth. It's just like a zero. That let's say a Baal plays, let, let's say a, a woman owned a chutzr herself, and the husband places the get in the chutzr. So placing it in the chutzr that belongs to the woman is like placing it in her hand. But let's say the Baal puts the get in a chutzr a neutral chutzr that does not belong to her. Later on, the woman buys the chutzr and the get is still there. It's not a good get because at the time that the husband gave it, it wasn't given to the woman nor to her chutzr. The fact that later on it passed into her possession, it's like she found the get like in the street. So here too, if the woman appoints a sheikh le Kabbalah, which in a sense is like her hand or chutzr, it was appointed after the husband had given the get to Ishlia. If we matter in that case, people will think that even if the woman didn't own the chutzr when the husband placed the get there, and she bought it afterwards, it would also work. Hello? Now, my binet, what's the difference between these two reasons? The, she, because of the bizarre of the Baal versus of, of this future chutzr. It could be now the kadmi ibi shavish lech meikara. Let's say the wife appointed a shlich like Kabbalah prior to the husband appointing a shlich loyloch of the earth. There's no problem of chutzr balach became, but because of bizarre and Abal, there would. It was a man that sent a get to his wife. The shliach shows up and the woman is kneading dough. The shliach says, here, take your get. Well, listen, my hands are dirty. Let the get be with you. And in a sense, making him a shliach with Kabbalah. Am Rav Nachman, im Isa le Rav Chanina, if the halach is like Rav Chanina, that the shlichim can work together without involvement of the principles. Avdi Ba'uvda, I would have matiered this woman to get divorced. Because even though it's the same shaliach, he says she's allowed to do it. Armelay Rava, the Rav Chanina, not this Pauvdi, you would have passed it like Rav Chanina. There's a concept that a shlichus doesn't terminate until the shaliach can go back to the one who sent him. And said, I accomplished my shlichas. So in this case, the shlich never fulfilled the shlichas of the Baal because he was in the middle, made a shlich by the wife, who was Mavata the shlichas, the original shlichas. So it is rejected as a shlichas because it doesn't fulfill the, the criteria of the ability of Lechazar shlichas, it's Labal. 
So this question was sent It's not a good get because the original shliach didn't fulfill the shliach. However, Rav Chia Bar Abba Omar, let me think about it a few days. So they let him think about it. Omar Kalani Azli. Many people are sending me these questions. Just like they were in doubt, we are also in doubt. And I don't have the answer. So there was no achra. But this is a suffix, Avidova Shabbat Erva, whether she's an Eshah Sish. So when Dover Shabbat Erva, Choylet says, so we're machmir, al suffix, she has to get clean. So if the ball dies, we don't see, we don't say that she's permitted to marry anybody. She has to get chlitza from the brothers. Maybe the original Nisun was not, not gotten rid of with the get. Can't have Yibum, because maybe there was a get, and, and brothers cannot be the, 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 the divorcee of, his, of her, of the brother. The Hava Uvda, case happened. The Itzrachay Revisit Bar Shmuel Bar Marta, Chlitz, get the Chlitz. They needed another get from the husband and Chlitz. Versus Tarti, if the Baal actually gave her a good get, there certainly doesn't have to be Klitsa. He wasn't married to him anymore when he died. In a Chanami, get Mechayim. If the Baal is alive, we only need get. But you need Klitsa if it happened after Misa. Ha Vukaru La Nafata. There was a woman they called her Nafata. And the husband gave a command to write her again. Also, Sadi, the Adim came, Kosuv Tafoto. They wrote her name wrong. The get's not good. But also, Adim Shlichuson, they can't go ahead and write another good get. Because they completed their their shlichus. Maski florov mikom lo ksuvu chaspa vavule. The husband didn't say go write the uh, go write this on a piece of pottery. Not it's not worth anything. He told them write a, a good get. Until they write a good get, they haven't completed their shlichus. Elo amar vada i kosuv sadi gitim alio. For example, if the shlichus they ate him and written a good get for avad. Got lost, but then also ate him shlichusim because they wrote a good get. They can't write a new get. But we don't say the same thing if they wrote a get puzzle. If they wrote a get puzzle, they're allowed to write a new get that's kosher. Maskel Rav Nachman. The husband didn't tell the Adam, go and write a get and stick it in your pocket that you can't give. He gave it, he told them, write again and be Magari sure. And with the Ksiva alone, their shlichus wasn't fulfilled. They should have a right to go and do it again. In every case, Koisvin, Benoisnim. If they lose it, whatever, they ate him, can write a new get and give it. Afilu may upon me, even if they lose it a hundred times. Boimene Rav and Rav Nachman. Kisfu Utnu. The Shaliyah. The Baal told Adim, write again and give it to the Shaliyah. Now, do we say Sluki Slikaluhu that they, their hands are done once they give the get to the Shaliyah and they can't write another get? He was trying to make it easier for them, for them not to have to go give the get by themselves. But the Shlichus remains. And they could write another get, or for example, the shaliach loses it. If the Baal said, not just kisfu utnu shaliach, but also sviyoylich la, give it to her, mouth. Does, the, does that add further strength that maybe they, would, they don't 
finish their shlichus until it's given, take. Rashi Begal Oimer Afoy Meres Toli Giti, the wife who appoints the shlich and says, "Take my get." Yimrat Salasu Layasur, because she appointed a shlich lekabola, and she was divorced the moment it hits the hand of the shlich. Tana Rabbanu. If the wife uses the following language, Toli, take for me, Tali. Carry for me. Yehli biyachet should be in your hands. Kulan lashon kabola. These are all lashon kabola, and and they, 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 the person would become a shleich lekabola. Okay, we'll stop here. Now tomorrow we go. We're going to learn at seven because we teach tzurba at eight thirty. Tomorrow the daf is seven. Tzurba at eight thirty. Have a good day, everybody. Tomorrow. Hey. Uh, Kaya. Shikoa. Shikoa. Shikoa.